Hey, good morning everyone. This is part two because my video cut off. Anyway, um, there's like this hollow emptiness in this room. And it makes me think of the song, like, you know when you have, you have stuff. But it's like, is there something else you're searching for? You know, <laughs> my voice is so, I just woke up. <clears throat> anyway, but yeah, it's like, are you still trying to fill that void? What is it that you're looking to put into the situation? Because you have things, but um, it's like you want to create memories. That's what's missing. Okay. So here we have the Eight of Pentacles. You're working with the earth. Um, working to build, working to establish something. And this is like, um, when I look at this, you know, I think of the miners. Right before, you know, the, the child labor laws were established and you had coal miners who had like children working in the coal mines. So for me, I'm thinking of the elements, like working with the elements. Um, and when I think of coal, I think of fire. Um, so it's like igniting new passionate ideas, perhaps collaborating with someone else, and turning that coal into a diamond. Like starting something from scratch. Okay. Now we have the full card <clears throat> in reverse. So it's like, okay, not taking a leap of faith, but um, it's like a, a feeling of hesitation, you know, not, I think not leaping into something foolishly. It could be a uh, aspect of theater that's in this. You could be an actor or actress. Kate Blanchett, um, she the Taurus. Okay. Then we have the King of Wands, the Leo Sagittarius Aries energy. Um, I don't know. <laughs> when I look at this, I look at, I think, power couple or something. It's really mainly about him, right? But they say behind every good man is a good woman or every strong man is a strong woman or whatever, whatever. Um, so there could be like an aspect of political science behind this or some sort of campaign towards something. But anyway, someone is um, like the archetype of the king of wands, the leader, someone in a position of authority, someone who is charismatic, someone who knows how to take action and execute their plans. And so, yeah, when I see this, I see partnership. It's partnership, partnership, partnership. Um, <clears throat> two of cups could be a partnership, could be a love relationship, could be a friendship, it could be something like that, right? Um, and then uh, here we go back to like the ancient knowledge. Uh, something deeply spiritual, something almost past life-ish. Um, it's like a purpose that is much bigger and greater than just the people who are paying, like playing the parts in this movie as it goes down. Um, 
11, 11. You see how many 11s there are? Let me show you. These pharaohs, I don't know. I'm sorry, I don't know which pharaoh this is. It could be Ramses, possibly. I don't know. And then we have um, Ra in the middle. So it's one, 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 one. And then their legs, one, 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 one. One, 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 one. So this is why this is like the four of wands, 11, 11. So it's like um, you're deciding to go into that temple and figure out what you find in there, right? So yeah, this is about a creative collaboration, working with someone else in order to move forward and establish something with a chariot card uh, it's like the battle you're taking on this like a spiritual battle and i see another partnership here there's two people one is directing the horses and one is shooting the um the arrows at the lions giving me a lot of like leadership energy like <laughs> spiritual battleists or something like that and there's three horses another three 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 okay it's sort of babylonian I'm just looking at their um, attire and their beards and their hats. It looks like this is from a, a Babylonian historical period. And we have Mona Lisa, the Empress. So this could be Libra Taurus, of course, energy. Um, someone who is uh, self-mastered who has mastered all of her queenships um, and is just ready to take on the challenge at hand. She, she views the world as Ubuntu, unity. Um, she has an understanding of self, which leads to understanding of earth, which leads to understanding of spirit, leads to the understanding of um, alchemy, and having an understanding of ancient knowledge here, right? Now the ocean eyes. <laughs> I'm trying to figure out. Um, it just could be. It just could be someone who has ocean eyes, or perhaps someone who likes Billy Eilish. Ooh, you know what I'm thinking of? Another Billy Eilish song. I had, oh my god, my voice is terrible this morning. <clears throat> Give me a second as I clear my throat. But I'm not going to sing it. I'm going to just say the lyrics. I had a dream that I had everything I wanted. Um, I forgot how the other lyrics go. But it's like basically... Um, The dream was, the dream was, like, having everything that she wanted was, it didn't mean anything without having, I guess, this particular partnership here with the Two of Cups and the Three of Pentacles, you know what I mean? So I think that's what I'm getting, especially how I, how I, Oh my god, they're so loud. How I began this reading is how I end, right? Tell me something, Lord. Are you still trying to feel that boy? Are you I'm 
as I feel myself longing for a change. <laughs> and in the good times I feel myself healthy and much as I die. Anyway, I just, I love this energy right here. I'm gonna leave it right there. Thank you so much for tuning in. Um, just to summarize this reading, it's like two people have a lot of what they want, but there's some sort of, uh, it's like this Luther Vandross song. This house is not a home, right? A chair is still a chair. But I don't know how the rest of it goes. But this house is not a home when there's no know how it goes I'm sorry I don't know the lyrics but I love that song but it's like this house is not a home and so I just see someone <clears throat> working on this working on some sort of partnership and it seems like a, some sort of spiritual partnership with all of this 11 11 and four of wands energy and power couple political something <laughs> collaboration it's all good though everything i'm seeing is super good all right thank you so much for tuning in